the future. So we start off with this number, right? Learning, playing. Nice catch. The name of the God is praying. Energetically growing in faith at Our Lady Queen of Angels. Every time I walk into school, I feel joy in my heart and I start to jump up. It feels magical to me. Our school and our church working hand in hand to cultivate the next generation of Catholics. Here at a Catholic school, it's just very, uh, very comfortable and convenient to become closer to God while practicing your studies. It's a very good place to be to learn about God and about some things you can do in life. For this future, we offer a vision to strengthen our parish and school ministries and complete our dream. Introducing the Cornerstone Campaign, Completing Our Dream, a prayerfully considered multi-pronged response to our incredible growth. For the kingdom, power. 300 founding families in 1961. Through him and with him. And More than 4,500 registered households today. And Queen of Angels is becoming a destination. It's a place that you want to come and pray and meet people and experience all that's been built over the last several years. We celebrate this growth and continue enhancing our campus to accommodate it. It's a statement to the community that this church represents Jesus Christ and this is a place where people can come to know and to love the Lord Jesus. Right here in the middle of Newport Beach, here is a living, thriving Christian community that tries to follow Jesus Christ. The first priority of our $10.5 million Cornerstone campaign, a new athletics and activity center, a safe indoor space where our children can grow physically, artistically, and socially. We are a great school. We offer so many things for our students currently, but this would just give us that next level to be able to reach that goal of educating the whole child. The center will feature a regulation basketball court, two volleyball courts, and a stage for performances. We normally don't have a stage, so it'd be better just to have a stage and there'd be more room. And I think it'd just be better because on rainy days, we don't have to stay inside, we could go into the gym. And instead of playing volleyball out on the hard blacktop, you can play it on the gym floor where you don't get hurt as much. This is something our school has been really wanting for a really long time. I would say probably 25 years or more. They've talked about having this multi-purpose space. So it's something that we really want to see come to fruition and happen for our school. So they don't have to constantly play on the playground or if it's raining, they don't have to go into the parish and just kind of walk around. They can be active, they can play games. Games and tournaments, adult activities, and youth ministry gatherings, the center will host them all. I think it'll give us a meeting place and a, and a hub for our athletics department where our students for PE classes or after school sports, they, have, they know they have that one place to go, a safe place to go, and a place they can be proud of. We have a wonderful school spirit that already exists with our students, but to enable them to really develop that and bring a closeness to our school and student body would be wonderful. And this is gonna be a structure that's gonna be here forever for your kids, your friends, your, your grandkids. Another dream that we will make a lasting reality, the building of a community room to alleviate the constant competition for meeting, ministry, and reception space. As with any you know, healthy, bustling parish comes you know, uh, the need for, for more space. There's a lot of different ministries that need the space. Glory to you, Lord Jesus. To have a beautiful arena where we can have women's breakfast or where the knights can meet or we can have our fish bakes during Lent season, the various holidays and the holiday receptions. I think it just keeps us more engaged within our parish and attracts more people. The additional space will be a true blessing for our Helping Hands ministry, allowing it to reach and better serve more people in need, people like Tony. The right resources have helped me to get back on my feet and I feel very safe and secure. We currently 
have our office in the child care room over in the church. Then the children come in on Sundays. And we don't have any storage either, that's a problem, because we get a lot of donations of toiletries and sleeping bags and blankets. And if we have no place to store that, it makes it difficult to, to give it out to the clients. The benefits of our Cornerstone campaign also include a new modern nursery to introduce our children to God. So if we want our Catholic community to continue in Newport Beach, we need to provide for the needs of our little ones. And of course, Jesus said, let the little ones come to me and do not hinder them. It will encourage young families to come knowing that their babies, their young children are going to be cared for, they're going to be happy, they're going to be close. And so they'll be able to come and just take that time for themselves to pray and to be connected. Your generosity will fund a pipe organ worthy of our worship. To me, the first thing is that anything we do when we worship God should be our best. So having an instrument of quality and durability, longevity, is the best we can offer God. And an expanded church plaza to gather for fellowship. The fellowship to me is everything. That's everything that I come to church for, is that sense of community, that friendship, that sense of belonging. Oh, oh, thank you very much. Finally, the Cornerstone campaign will let us fulfill our commitment to parishes in need. As Christians and as Catholics, and you think about humanitarian from the standpoint of helping those less fortunate, there are some parishes that may not be as affluent as Our Lady Queen of Angels, and to be able to give them, you know, whatever it's necessary to help them to continue preaching gospel and, and the Word of God is very important. In the unity of the Holy Spirit. OLQA has always been blessed with a dedicated and generous congregation. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Since 1961, our progress and success through God's will has been because of you. Now we are asking for your help once again. The athletic and activity center will be used by all of our parishioners. The pipe organ will be listened to by all of our parishioners. And the community room will be used also uh, for all of our parishioners. Please join us through prayer and generosity in completing our dream. Completing the dream. Completing the dream. Completing the dream. Completing the dream. Behold the Lamb of God. All of us should pray about how we can help in this campaign. But participating in the campaign makes you feel special when you walk into church. We've been given a lot of gifts through God, and now's the time for us to use some of those gifts and give them to the community and to the church. Together is important. As a community, all of these things are important. Catholic schools cannot exist except in community. Our parish cannot exist without everyone helping. Our parishioners are very generous with their time, their talent, and their treasure. That's the only way this can happen, the only way our dream can come true, because of everyone working together. Working together, growing in faith, and completing our dream. Our Lady Queen of Angels, the Cornerstone Campaign, completing our dream.